Dear viewers, welcome you all to our show, OSA, that is Orthopedic Solution Academy. Hope you all are well during this COVID-19 pandemic situation by wearing mask and keeping distance with each other. Dear viewers, uh, today our topic is Elizabeth effect in orthoplasty. That means the combined treatment of post burn contracture of the toes. And the presenter is the very magnificent and learned presenter, Professor Novikov Sir uh, from Kurgan Institute of Russia. I would like to request uh, Professor uh, Novikov Sir to join with us. And we have a uh, learned academic panel with us. Uh, one of them is Professor Mopakharul Bari Sir. I would like to request Professor Mufakarul Barisa to join with us. And another one is uh, Dr. Shamsul Budasar from Patna, India. And the other one is uh, Dr. Chunu Sir from Mauritius. I would like to request all of them to join with us. Barisa, Hello, good afternoon. Please. Yeah, good afternoon, Dr. Shamsul Budasar. Uh, Professor Baris Sir, Mufakarul Barisa, would you please join with us? Dear viewers, uh, today our topic is a little bit different. That is uh, the irreserve effect in orthoplasty. Uh, how it is possible? Is it absolutely possible or not? Definitely, we are going to know these things after the magnificent presentation by our honorable speaker, Professor Novikov sir. Now, I'd like to uh, request uh, Professor Novikov sir uh, to start his uh, presentation. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, all of uh, colleagues. <clears throat> and uh, today I want to uh, introduce uh, some interesting uh, experience in our department when we start to uh, collaborate uh, absolutely different uh, surgeon, uh, Elizarov, orthopedic surgeon and plastic surgeon. And I want to congratulate all of us with the century since Elizarov was 70 years of Elizarov methods and 50 years Kurgan Elizarov Center. Near 40 years I work in this clinic and I am happy because more than nine years I work shoulder to shoulder with this great person. And methods of treatment by Elizarov of contracture of toys. Uh, maybe uh, this is methods will come in our practice because uh, this is a little bit rare surgery. Presently, we do not have one single method to treat toy contracture because problem is to re return to the correct, uh, corrected position of the toys after surgery. And post-burn deformity is a severe complications of thermal injury to the foot. Foot burn contracture are specific by their topographic location, the extent and severity of the burn wound and scars that can develop on the dorsal, volar, interdigital aspects of the foot, causing flexions and adductions, contracture of the entire foot, flexion and extensions, contracture of toys, shortening of the Achilles tendon, plantar aponeurosis, etc. Scars deformity of the foot are reported to range between five to seven and adults and in 10% of all burn deformities of the localization in children. The dorsum of the foot and toys are involved in more than 80 of the cases. Anatomically, the dorsal aspect of the foot is characterized by the proximity, proximate, <coughs> proximity of the ligamentous, articular, vascular, and nerve structure of the foot and skin. 
epidermis protecting the malpingian layer of the skin from the environment measure 0.1 to 1 millimeters. The ligaments of tendon around the dorsum of the foot and the ankle are covered by thin skin being nearly void of subcutaneous fat. Deep dorsal burns of the foot result from minor exposure to an external head sources involving many anatomical structure into a pathological process that lead to clinical and functional deformities of the segment. Burn deformities in the dorsum of the foot can be caused by both the cutaneous injury follow, <coughs> followed by scarring and the secondary involvement of underleading tissue into the scarring and changes in the ligaments articular structure. The pathological scars lead to cutaneous scars contractures in <coughs> in conjunction with autogenic dysfunction. Thick root measure scars develop on the dorsum of the foot being suspect, uh, susceptible to recurrent trauma from use of road footwear and can re <coughs> result in Hyperkeratosis keroid, uh, or ulceration adhesis of skin to underlead tissue. The factors can lead to eliminated plantar flexions of the foot, subflexions, and dislocations in the digital joint, reduction clinical and functional capacity of the segment, and causing major cosmetic problems, inability to wear normal footwear with resultant impaired quality of the uh, life and uh, physical and physical rule limitation. Scars bands run over the dorsum of the foot either as a solid entity or reach each of the toys in the <clears throat> fun-like manner causing our extension of the metatarsal phalangeal joint. Neglected deformities in pediatric populations can result in secondary foot deformities, dilated groin and bone malignant. <clears throat> the patient retain full range of motion in the joint of the foot and toys and facilities favorable outcome of the real time surgical treated. Bone wounds may heal with keloid scars due to specific anato uh, anatomy and physiology of the foot. Keloids may appear even the relatively superficial burn and can develop an intercolosity <coughs> and uh, ulceration being susceptible to the recurrent trauma. Extensive uh, persistent trophic ulcer that fail to resolve spontaneously can be closed with different flap design of skin plastics. It is essential to select an appropriate technique for furry foot, reconstructive surgery in safe deformity, severe deformity of the segment, depending on location and extension of the involved area. Treated options included skin grafts, local flap, and free flaps. Ex extensive soft tissue release and uh, complete resection a required uh, for reconstruction of a severe for a full deformity. However, skin grafts and uh, local flap provide limited soft tissue coverage making 
reconstruction surgery difficult in many cases. The known treated treatment options for severe beyond contracture and deformities of the dorsum of the foot include skin plastic with the filatov tube pedicle for adequate, adequate skin coverage of the defect followed by the hinged distraction <coughs> fixation system. Patients who experience total and subtotal burns have shortage of donor tissue availability in the technique cannot be applied for them. In our options, the below techniques can be the methods of the choice of the ch such cases. The surgical interventional includes existence of core scars of the dorsal aspects of toys and both feet out of uh, Logeos full sickness, skin grafting of cutaneous defect uh, combined with plasty and interdigital web space and toys. In the Lizard of external fixator was applied to create conditions for gradual longitudinal uh, tractions of uh, problematic toys, distensible corrections of the deformity and sublocations in the metatarsial uh, phalangeal joints. Elizarov mini fixator was attached any atypically to the plantar aspects of the foot only to leave the dorsum free from metal construct to easy dressing and uh, manipulations with uh, autologous full sickness skin grafts. The so-called wire and wire uh, tractions or treated soft tissue structure uh, fusion, fusion toys to the plantar surface of the foot were traditionally used by surgeons to extend and hold the toys in the relating position. The message was often associated with bed sores development in the nine burying toys due to the pressure from the needle spill or cutting through the soft tissue. The techniques we offered included uh, the use of fine uh, one millimeter wires placed in digital uh, phalanges, uh, phalanges in the coral, coronal plate at the same level and curved in a special manner. Symmetrical double bending was produced for the phalangeal wire driving in the frontal plane. The wire was first bent on both sides of the toy one millimeter of uh, the skin at 90 degree in vertical plane. And then it was bent at the same 90 degree in the sagittal plane, three, four millimeters of the first bending. The wires were framed being uh, the nail plane with free ends locked or looped. Оль, я читаю, я перезвоню потом. A longer free end of the wire was fixed to remove nodule with the possibility of uh, producing gradual distensible traction, allow the axis with the toys not touching each other and the metal contract components. The insensible tractions was provided with uh, wire elasticity and bendings. The techniques allow for corrections of severe combined burn deformity of the foot and toys consistently maintain the intraoperative result and uh, providing 
and easy absorbing retention of uh, grafting tissue, change in dressing and uh, patient's mobility. The above approach can be illustrated with a clinical intestine. A nine years old uh, girl sustained a boiled water burn uh, a year before admission. She used natural home, they made it for five months. The wounds reeled with the cause scars and the patients developed a severe burn scars deformity of the feet and disturbing gait. As before treatment, patient cannot use uh, normal shoes, can, cannot normally work. Severe contracture, we can say uh, sublux, uh, luxation, full luxation, certain force array. <clears throat> And physical examination of the patients revelated causes hypertrophic scars on the dorsum and the feet and the lateral surface of the tibia. <clears throat> Start plastic surgeon, remove uh, severe keloid scars, then take uh, free flap uh, from body then we apply this is uh, funny Elizarov but magic support operative interventions were performed consistently of uh, bo uh, both feet first on the left side and then a similar uh, procedure was uh, produced on the right side after the frame had been removed from the left foot Tourniquet was applied intraoperatively to the mid third of the femur, and uh, the scars were exist on the dorsum of the left foot on the base of toes. Hemostasis was uh, produced and uh, edges of the wound mobilized. The cutaneous defect was uh, partially repaired using the Upper, uh, upper used cut of uh, triangular flap then were fixed with uh, interrupted donative teachers after the transfer and prolen 5.0 suture were applied to the skin. The toy were stretching it and attempt were made to bring the third, fourth and fifth toys flexions but filed due to rigid and you shape flap with the base to the plantum where were cut off the second third and fourth interdigital web space the flap were invented and fixed it on the dorsum on the foot at the level of metatarsal phalangeal joints Full thickness skin was uh, how vested from the right side, growing area to cover the defect of the foot. Donor wound in the right iliac area was sutured layer after layer with interrupted donut stretches. Recreal 4.0 sutures were used for the subcutaneous tissue and uh, prolent 5.0 point sutures were applied it to the skin. The graft was uh, treated with the Prasavitov technique and uh, placed as a subcutaneous defect site of the foot and sutured in the perimated with the interrupted stitches. A septic dressing with uh, traumatic mesh gas was applied to the wound. Overall, Operating time with use to the tourniquet was near one hour, 50 minutes. We applied to the plantar aspect 
for the plastic surgeon to the work. Gradual traction was provided uh, for tense post-operative days for st stretching and reducing subluxation in the third, fourth, and fifth metatarsal uh, uh, phalangeal joints to bring those to the flexions. It was comfortable enough uh, for the patient due to the minimum forces development uh, by the frame and aim it to address the articular component of the contracture. Full thickness skin graft appear it uh, to stretch easily and pain free to toy attractions, getting uh, the toys to flex. The toys were shoot to get flexed and uh, the frame was uh, transferred to the fixation mode for three weeks to follow full integration of uh, autologous skin graft into the wound bin and was ta taken of the same time with sutural removal. The patient received antibiotics, medications to improve microcirculations and uh, relegations blood uh, properties. And uh, we not uh, remove stitch uh, in our dressing room. When was uh, second surgery, we remove uh, these uh, stitches. And after similar surgical produced, was uh, produced for the right foot after the uh, frame had been removed from the left side. Nothing the bilateral foot deformities could be visualized uh, radiological and uh, two and a half months follow up. The patient underwent complete rehabilitation for another months. This is before treatment. Therefore, the above clinical study was show that a several burn, severe burn foot deformity can be treated within one surgical section using combined skin plasty and the Elizarov external fixation addressing subluxated toys, subductively scars and the dorsum of the foot, etc. To facil uh, facilitate good clinical and functional outcomes, food growing and development in pediatric population. However, further improvement of the technique is needed to include classifications, algorithm of examinations and selections of the treatment strategy, depending on individual characteri uh, characterization of anatomical and functional impairment of the foot. This uh, would allow the wider applications of the technique at different levels of uh, health care system. Before and photograph of follow limb at the two years after surgery. I think just now this is a young girl and her parents is more than happy. Before treatment and uh, when uh, same uh, situation without uh, Elizarov orthopedic surgeon start treat plastic surgeon uh, they have a result but not so good when we uh, start uh, support this patient without plastic surgeon uh, already uh, we have some results but not so good but when we uh, collaborate we have result like that. I can say this is imagine fantastic result for me and uh, for plastic surgeon. And next. Slides I want again talk about our father about subjective and objective and 
Elizarov give us freedom, give us possibilities, give us future and give uh, possibilities uh, connect uh, with so many doctors and uh, see what say surgeon <clears throat> from Islamic country about Elizarov methods. Congratulate all of us with genius, with methods. Uh, this is uh, plastic surgeon. This is another plastic surgeon, uh, Mr. Karastelov and Mrs. Shikhaleva, great surgeon. And uh, when we collaborate uh, with so many different, uh, not only uh, uh, toys contracture, and uh, for example, knee contracture, uh, elbow contracture, when we uh, work together, result is magic. Thank you very much for your attention, for your time. And I hope uh, in the future we can uh, find another uh, place, another uh, area when we can use this is fantastic effect, effect of Elizarov. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Thank sir, you. for your excellent presentation. Uh, uh, that was a magical presentation. Now, I would like to request uh, Professor Mopakarul Barisa to share his uh, experience. Uh, before that, I would like to welcome uh, Professor uh, Indrana Chunu, sir, uh, because of, uh, he uh, joined with us in the mid part of the presentation. Sir, welcome. Welcome to our show, Optimistic Solution. Chunu. Now our great Chunno is. Yeah, now I would like to request Professor Mafakarul Barisa. Sir, uh, do you have uh, uh, any experience uh, regarding the yes. correction of uh, post burn contracture? Uh, mm -hmm. As I know, you have done this. Uh, so please, would you please share your valuable experience with us? Uh, first of all, uh, all the panelists and the speaker. Uh, Professor Novikov, he nicely elaborated, elaborated everything regarding the post burn contracture and the treatment. And here, you know, we are getting also a lot of cases in our country, and we have a very, we have a burn institute, 500 bedded hospital in Dhaka, and as well as the Dhaka Medical College. We have a special 500 barn unit center in Dhaka. And a lot of cases, uh, the post barn contractures that is treated by Elizarov. And Professor Novikov nicely showed the, especially the deformed cases after the barn, in case of the uh, phalanges and in between the he elaborated everything by using the simple 1 mm K wire. And he has taken the help of Professor Shikilova and Karastova there. I was there in their unit. It's a very good unit, fantastic. They are doing combinedly with the Elizarov as well as the plastic surgery. So it gives a very good result. Regarding this, and he has showed nicely the before surgery and after the surgery, a long-term follow. One thing that I could not understand that one, uh, he mentioned Krasovitov technique. Uh, can you uh, tell me that that is in Kurgan Center? Can you uh, tell me uh, how you applied that one? Chektika Krasovitova. Professor Navitov, sir, can you hear us? Mm. 
I think uh, there is some network problem is there. Uh, Professor Navikum sir, can you hear us? We, can, we cannot uh, hear you properly. And I think your network is disturbing there. Anyway, uh, Professor uh, Mafakarul Bari sir. Good case, Navikum, fantastic sir. case. Because, because again, if you think about the principle of Ilizar, again, law of tension is stress. That, that and dislocation. You can go for gradually, gradually by differential destruction. You can cover the deformity, contracture, alloys, as well as the subluxation and the dislocation cases. And Professor Novikov nicely demonstrated the cases. These are the difficult cases without the lizard of on the deformity and as well as the subluxation and the dislocation. And with Elizarov, mini Elizarov fixator, with bows, small bows, you can gradually, when you will ap apply the Elizarov law, that is slow and steady traction on a living tissue, creates a stress which is metabolically activated and which stimulates histoneogenesis, genesis, destruction of osteogenesis. And thank you very much, Professor Novikov. So I'd like to only know the that one. Krasovitov technique, if you can describe me that one. Can you listen to me, Professor Novikov? Uh, Professor Novikov, sir, can you can you hear us, sir? Uh, I think uh, uh, Professor Navikov, sir, can't hear us. Yeah, I think he has network issues. Yeah, he has network issues there. Okay, but uh, I would like to request uh, uh, Dr. Shamsuluda, sir, do you have anything uh, to share uh, with us uh, regarding the topic, the postborn contracts yeah. or like that? Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Dr. Tanvir. Uh, I have a short experience in. Uh, doing lengthening of toes in post burn contracture cases, especially in predating and adult cases, both not deformities. So I have done this uh, uh, shortening of toes in foot with uh, small distractors, not with Elizaro. And that works very well. A uh, uh, few of the cases I've got in uh, predating cases, few are uh, the young lady who could not marry because of this. So uh, it works very well with these cases. Okay, that's great. That's great. Uh, but how long it takes? to recover around uh, uh, i think 3 months approximately is uh, fine because the lending uh, toe lending is there in around uh, 2 to 3 weeks is, uh, two is fine and then we leave the distractor as such to regenerate and around uh, uh, 8 weeks or 12 weeks it consolidates well so in 3 months you can easily remove that okay that's good uh, can you use uh, that distractor in uh, any other part of the body Yes, the distractors can be used in hands, the fingers. You can use like here in the metacarpals, the uh, phalanges as well. And a uh, few of the, I have seen a uh, few of the uh, maxillary facial surgeons, they have been using in this uh, mandible lengthening also. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. That's, a, that's a, a great thing. I uh, hope uh, we will see in the coming part of yeah. our program uh, from uh, Dr. Shamsuluda, sir. Uh, like this type of uh, presentation, yeah. by lengthening by a small distractor. Uh, we, we are waiting for that. Now, I would like to uh, request uh, Dr. Uh, Chunu, sir. Sir, uh, do you want to contribute something uh, regarding our topic? First, you have to, sir, unmute yourself. Please unmute yourself. We can't hear you, uh, Professor Chunu, sir. Please unmute yourself. Sir, please unmute, sir. Sir, please unmute yourself. Uh, uh, it is uh, below your screen, sir. The lower part of your screen.
Uh, Professor Chenu, sir, we can't hear you, sir. Uh, please unmute yourself. Uh, can you give him a WhatsApp call? Yeah, I think so. No, sir, we can't hear you, sir, uh, Professor. Chunu, sir, we can't hear you. I think uh, we are facing networking problem here. Uh, most of the panelists are facing the network problem. The dear viewers, uh, uh, today we are discussing about the topic that is the Elizabeth effect in uh, orthoplasty. Sometimes we use the combined treatment effect in case of post burn contracture. Uh, uh, we can use a team uh, for plastic surgeon as well as the Elizabeth surgeon, both to help the uh, patient to recover from this type of contracture. And in uh, Bangladesh, uh, we are also doing the uh, Elizabeth in case of post bond contracture. We have lots of case history there, uh, especially our Professor Mopakarul Barisar uh, did these things. Uh, a lot of cases are there, and I hope we will discuss uh, these things. We will. I uh, take uh, this sort of presentation once more uh, to you in the coming part of our program. And you also came to know that, that we can uh, make the lengthening also by the small distractor as Dr. Shamsuruddha sir says, and we are hoping and that uh, Dr. Shamsuruddha sir will present uh, this type of presentation in the coming part of our program. And we are eagerly waiting for uh, that type of presentation. And uh, today, as because of we're facing uh, some sort of networking problem, uh, so I would like to end up our program uh, now. And I would like to thank uh, uh, everyone uh, who were with us, uh, especially uh, I would like to thank uh, Professor Navikov sir for his excellent presentation. Uh, and I would like to thank uh, Professor Chenu sir for uh, joining with us, uh, though well, we are facing some sort of networking problem uh, so that we can't hear him, but I uh, hope uh, I uh, will uh, recover these things in the coming part of our program. And I would like to thank the Professor Mofa Karulbari, sir, and a special thanks to Dr. Shamsi Ruza, sir. And I am Dr. Mohit Andriya saying bye-bye to you. And definitely, I would like to thank Raj TV and Renata Pharmaceuticals Limited for being with us. Dear viewers, uh, so you stay with us and you stay with Orthopedic Solution Academy to take the Elizar of Magical Information. And I'd like to say bye bye to everyone. Bye bye. You are watching Raj TV, Jagorone, Bangladesh. Please subscribe our channel.